Daily Devotionals for October 31st. Today's scripture reading will be Acts 16, verses 16 through 18. Now it happened as we went to prayer that a certain slave girl possessed with the spirit of divination met us, who brought her masters much money uh, for fortune telling. See, she was steeped in this spirit of divination. It had actually possessed her and therefore her masters, the people who probably owned her, uh, used her to tell people's fortunes and make money. They still do that today. This girl followed Paul and us and cried out saying, these men are the servants of the most high God who proclaim to us the way of salvation. See that demon, uh, the girl, the demon possessed the girl, but yet the girl is the one crying out that she knew, you know, and actually the demon knew that these men were proclaiming the way of salvation and that they served the Most High God. Verse 18, and this she did for many days. Paul, greatly annoyed, turned and said to the spirit, I command you in the name of Jesus Christ to come out of her. And he came out of her that hour. Now, you know, apparently, you know, Paul, had given her grace to a point all right and but she followed him day after day and it truly was aggravating to him and i think uh he waited for the appropriate time and with permission from the lord to cast that demon out there had to be the right timing and i know i learned this from from bob there was especially this one person that it was had a demonic spirit and i said to bob like why don't you cast it out <laughs> he said it's not time yet so there's a timing in that but when the time was appropriate then he spoke to it he didn't speak to the girl he spoke to the spirit to come out i think a lot of times when people do deliverance ministry if you don't know what you're doing that's what they do they're speaking to the person and you never want to speak to the person because it's not the person like it was this girl it was the uh demon was possessing her and causing her to uh you know lash out at them what have you so you always want to address the demon in the name of jesus to come out okay well you know i i was reading this the other day i thought well we'll just save that for halloween because it's uh you know Halloween is really rooted in pagan um, roots and you know there's a lot of things over the years I think that has developed more and more and more so you know ghosts and goblins and witches and they get into occult practice and lots of things but I just thought this was rather interesting because it does speak about the spirit of divination okay all right till next time be blessed